endothermal ablation. During endothermal ablation, the veins affected by reflux are treated from the inside with heat energy. I perform this under local anaesthetic under ultrasound guidance. With an ultrasound probe on the skin, the unhealthy vein is located and the skin overlying the vein is numbed with local anaesthetic and then a small needle is inserted into this vein. Through the needle, a fine catheter is inserted into the vein and advanced along the vein under the skin and positioned accurately to the site where the superficial vein joins the deep vein, confirmed by ultrasound. The vein is then numbed with a series of local anaesthetic injections, again guided by ultrasound. Thereafter, the vein is heated from the inside, hence the term endothermal ablation to a temperature at which the vein is closed and cauterized and the cells of the vein are sterilized. Thereafter, the vein cannot recover, it can't reopen or rejoin with the deep veins and the superficial venous reflux is effectively cured. After endothermal ablation, the varicous veins disperse, varicose eczema or leg ulceration can heal and any associated spider veins will also disperse. Large varicose veins can be extracted at the same time, a procedure called phlebectomy.